my darlings, so I haven't poured in a while, so I'm really excited today. I am going to pour on this beautiful wood piece. So usually, you know that I love my wood pieces, but usually they're about this thick, like half the size of this, maybe a little less than that. Look how beautiful this looks. I can't wait to make this. I think I'm gonna make this like a, some kind of like table centerpiece like I usually do. I'm eventually gonna pour resin on it. I really like this one, guys, because I don't know if you could see this, but there's a lot of grains and there's a lot of the, like the little circles that go in. And this one kind of has like these little, I don't know what these are, but like these little brown dots and marks. And once I pour on one side, because you know I like to leave a part of the wood open, when I pour resin on it after it dries, it becomes so beautiful. The wood gets darker and all these details pop out and it just, it's amazing. I love texture. I love that these come like that. So that's what we're going to do. And today I am going to pour on, what are my colors here? Okay, guys, okay, so today I'm going to be using um, Art, Alter uh, Art Alternative. Art Alternative. Say that three times fast. So, the blue, the black. Where are my colors? I'm not ready today, guys. Oh my goodness. I didn't put my colors all out. I'm going to use this really pretty blue color, too. So, this one is called Cobalt Blue. And in the blue, I'm going to put a little bit of black, just a touch to darken it because I want it to be more of a, like a medium midnight blue something between the blue and a really dark blue and I'm gonna add a little bit of green to it this is Amsterdam's um, standard series the acrylic and it's called emerald green so I'm gonna add a touch of that to give it just a little bit of a greeny blue color um, and that's it guys oh no that's not it. I'm really not prepared today and I'm going to be using my sergeant art you guys know I love my gold and this is one of my favorite golds ever it pours really well it sells really well so I'm gonna be using this so this is the sergeant art liquid metal acrylic paint and I think the color is just um, where is the color? it's just gold so that's the one I am going to be using Floatrol you guys last time on my video you guys criticized me a lot because I called it I think I call it I call it fluid Fluid, fluidrol. See now I'm all confused. But you guys saw told me it's fluidrol. I, don't know, I pronounce things words. I'm gonna be using that. In that, guys, I'm gonna be using a little bit of water with that, and also I'm gonna put silicone oil. So, here we go. Okay guys, so something different I did this time for my other videos, you know how much I love my torch. But I realized when I do the torch, 
I get really, really small cells like I always do in my other ones. So this time I put a lot of silicone oil in my paints and as you can see my cells are really big and they're still developing it, like develops over time so it's not only in the first few minutes. So if you want really big cells guys use a lot of silicone in your paints. I like mixing the silicone more with the Floatrol, not just so much with the water. Um, I love how this is, the cell keeps getting bigger, just a very different cell look than I usually get. So I hope you guys enjoy this, I hope you guys like this color scheme. Don't forget guys, give me a thumbs up on this video, make sure you're subscribed, and I will see you guys soon.